James chapter 3, verse 9 says, Therewith bless we God, even the Father. And therewith curse we men, which are made after the similitude of God. You say, what does that mean? What is the similitude of God? Well, we will be discussing that this week here on this channel, Sunday morning, 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. I'm going to be joined by Brother Jacob Thompson. Uh, he has just finished his book on the Godhead, the glory of the Lord, and uh, which totally debunks both Trinitarianism and modalism, the two false systems of trying to explain who God is and the makeup of God. And um, we're going to be destroying that the heresies of both Trinitarianism, Trinitarianism and modalism and uh, be discussing this thing of men, man being made after the similitude of God because that's really the whole argument. That's, that's everything right there. And when you understand what the similitude of God is and how man is made after the similitude of God, boom, it's over. Trinitarianism is false and modalism is false. So I would like to invite all the heretic Trinitarians and all the heretic oneness, Pentecostals, modalists, whatever you want to call yourself. You can, you're free to come and tune into the live stream and you'll see your system destroyed uh, and what the Bible actually teaches about who God is. And, um, be respectful, be kind. There will be question and answer thing at the end about the study. And uh, should be a lot of fun. Moderators, beware. <laughs> uh, I'm sure that uh, it'll be an interesting time. But um, we're going to be uh, talking about some things and, and going over some of what the Lord has showed Brother Jacob in his, in his book that's going to be released very soon. And uh, so we should have a lot of fun on Sunday morning. Again, this channel, KJVM Brian Denlinger, that's me, my name, um, and it will be 10 a.m. Sunday morning, uh, Eastern Standard Time. All right, tune in if you want to, uh, and behave yourself if you're one of these heretic people, and hopefully you'll learn something. So that's going to be it. See you Sunday morning.